Hello, I'm Jackie West. We have some breaking news to share with you today regarding Liberty Quarry, which is the proposed open pit mine near Temecula. Now today, the Pachanga Band of Luceno Indians agreed to buy the Liberty Quarry site for $20 million. Now joining me today is reporter Jeff Horseman. Jeff, you pretty much covered this since the very beginning. What happened today? Well, what happened was uh, Quarry Developer Granite Construction and the Pachanga Tribe um, issued joint statements basically where the tribe is agreeing to acquire about 354 acres of quarry property for $3 million. And then the Pachanga will also pay Granite another about $17 million. Uh, basically, as far as I can tell, it's part of an agreement that's going to end this whole dispute, which has been going on for seven years. And a couple other conditions attached to it. Uh, Granite has agreed not to uh, own or operate or, or build a quarry um, within a certain radius. I think it's like six miles north of the quarry site and three miles south of the quarry site. And in exchange, the tribe will also help uh, Granite if they want to uh, do an aggregate facility Outside that radius, uh, Pechanga has agreed to help them um, assess the impact to potential cultural and historically sensitive areas. You know, so, so basically, Pechanga is going to help Granite identify, hey, if you're looking at uh, building a quarry here, here's some cultural and historical artifacts or concerns you might want to take into account. Um, you've been talking about this, it's been going on for seven years. There's been countless public hearings attracting hundreds if not thousands of people, and, and sometimes pretty emotional. And on the one hand, you got people who wanted this quarry, who said, you know, who, who believed they would bring high quality jobs and would be kind of an economic shot in the arm. On the other hand, you had people, particularly near Temecula, who were very concerned about the quality of life, or concerned what they said was going to be the air pollution coming from this, was going to be the truck traffic, was going to be the damage to local tourism and the environment. And so with this agreement, this basically, you know, puts this quarry plan on the shelf. Now, you know, what Granite ends up doing if they try to pick another site in Riverside County to go. I mean, there's still a, a lot of things to unfold, but, uh, you know, we can, I think we can say for sure that, uh, you know, this quarry plan as we know it is over. Now, have you had, I know this news just broke recently. Have you had the chance to speak to any of the tribe members on the phone at all? Well, I haven't had a chance to speak to the tribe members directly, but the statements that were issued by Grant and the tribe included um, a, a quote or two from the tribal chairman, Mark McCarr, who obviously is very pleased, uh, believes the sale is going to preserve what they consider to be, you know, almost like a Garden of Eden type site for them. They, they consider this site part of the, uh, where the world began, and they were very concerned about a quarry kind of, a, you know, in their view, erasing it from the map. Uh, so they're pleased, uh, you know, Granite's happy, obviously, they're going to get some financial compensation. Um, and obviously the people who are opposed to this, I'm sure, are, uh, are very happy right now. Exactly. Now, as a reporter who's covered this for several years, how do you feel now that this is kind of ending this chapter? Well, I, you know, it's been an interesting story to cover. I mean, it's involved politics, it's involved science, it's involved uh, economics. And, you know, certainly, I mean, you know, as a reporter, you don't root for one side or the other to, uh, to take hold in this. But uh, I will say, you know, I didn't expect the quarry issue to wrap up before the uh, Riverside County Board of Supervisors election, uh, which is still neck and neck uh, with Kevin Jeffries holding a slightly over Bob Buster. Perfect. All right. Thanks, Jeff. I appreciate it. Uh, stay with PE.com for all the latest updates on this story. And go ahead and leave us a comment and let us know what you think. Don't forget, you can also check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. I'm Jackie West. Thanks for watching.